Hi guys, today has been a lesson in frustration, not a lesson, an exercise in futility. Is that what it is? Anyway, I'm not upset about it or anything. Um, so these MIDI files that I recorded on my keyboard, I wanted to make them into WAV files or MP3, something that my phone or my tablet would recognize and be able to play. Did I tell you guys this yet? MIDI files are the are the is the data, the the blitz and bleeps and binary data that tells um, a device what sounds to make and how long and gives all the sound information. It's not actual sound like if you record on a recorder. You're recording the sound. You play it back, it's going to sound just like you because it's the same thing. My keyboard records in MIDI's, and all those files I made are MIDI's, and when I play them back on that keyboard, they sound perfect, just like I played them. The reason is because, or if I wanted to drive my sister nut, nuts, the reason why is because there is a Yamaha sound font in there that records it and plays it back. So you're using the same font, so it's going to sound exactly the same. Just like if you write the, a word in the same font, you look at it, it looks the same because it's the same font. Well, anything else doesn't have that Yamaha font set. It's got its own MIDI fonts for, for interpreting the instructions from the MIDI file. So it sounds different on everything else. There are chunks missing. There are, it just is different, and it sounds wrong. My other keyboard is good. Um, it's also Yamaha, but it is nowhere near the keyboard that this one is. I love it, but it's nowhere near the keyboard this is. So it has a, MIDI, a Yamaha MIDI font set, but doesn't have everything this one has so it still sounds there's instruments missing here and there and rhythms and uh, whatever because it can't read them all that this one recorded so purpose of all this was so that i could um the purpose of all this was so that i could record them on onto another device phone tablet whatever and if I was not here, if I was out camping, which is kind of funny, but we don't always have electricity, but if I was out somewhere, wanted to play my ukulele with all my backups, I'd have it with me on my phone or whatever. But that obviously won't work. So step one, I tried converting those MIDI files to WAV files. However, that I should know that doesn't work for the reasons I just went into. So then I thought, okay, got to figure something else out. I read the manual, I scoured the manual and found I can indeed play and record WAV files on that keyboard. And I can record them right to a USB, my USB stick that I keep in my keyboard, thereby enabling myself to transfer them to other devices. 40 seconds, 47 seconds, and every single song, it would just stop. Just quit. It won't go on. Of course, it would save that 40 second seconds, but what good is that to me? So I went to my PSR tutorial website, of which I'm a lifetime member. I love that site. I don't participate in the forums or in all that stuff. But I do read the stuff when I have a problem like this to find the answers. And I wanted to support them, so I did. Um, but it is, I found the answer, but it didn't work on my keyboard. So at that point, I realized, oh, I can take my laptop and just play it into that and record it with Audacity. Get the same thing. That's perfect. Move my laptop out here, you know, plugged it in, 
Then I couldn't find the cable that goes between the keyboard and the laptop. It took me, I don't know how long, I looked everywhere in this, in the RV and in the house could not find the cable. So I was like, ah, oh, bummer. Finally, Pete gets up, he found it in one place I would never even think to look. But he found the cable. I'm like, cool. I can plug it right into the back of the keyboard. Now all I got to do is plug it in the line in on my computer. Oh, wait. There is no line in. There's only a, mic a headset one, not a microphone thing to plug in. That won't work. So I thought, well, I'll get my old computer out laptop. It works fine. The only thing it doesn't do is stay online. That's got to be fixed or whatever. But anyway, so I dragged that out. It hasn't been used in several years. So it was under and packed behind. It was anyway, it took me a while. I got it out. But that doesn't have a line in either. So at that point, I threw up my hands. But that was my entire afternoon was chasing down all those things because each one of those things required a lot of chasing down and trial and error. So that was my afternoon. So this evening, I made side tan for Pete for the first time. I took a picture of it in the pan. Um, it is a artificial or vegan meat. I made this one chicken made with uh, plant-based protein rather than animal-based protein. Very simple to make. It tastes delicious. Texture, you know, he hasn't tried it yet, but um, I think it'll be better after I fry it. I made four patties of it, and I think it'll they'll be better after I fry them. Um, and then I'm going to make, then I also made for the first time cashew cream sauce. Amazing. You soak the cashews overnight. Pete's not a big fan of cashews, and who wants cream that tastes like cashews? But soak it overnight, and then you blend it and add a little acid. And um, it called for lemon juice, but we don't have a lemon, so I used a little ACV. And uh, water to the right consistency, and you blend it till it's creamy smooth. Tastes like dairy. It does not taste like cashew. The soaking must took all the, uh, not took, took in, must have taken out all the um, flavor. It's delicious. So I'm going to add a little of his chicken flavoring to it, heat it up, and I fry the chicken, and that's, he'll have chicken with, like, kind of creamy gravy type thing over it. And I forgot about potatoes or noodles or rice or, anything else because I was so concentrating on this um anyway so that's what's going on that's my day uh that's my entire day so far it's 20 to 7 I think I can fry his stuff now although I just happened to think with the broth I have left I could fr make some noodles in there Throw some peas in, he'll have a side dish. So I think I'll do that too. Anyway, I'm going to go. Um, just thought I'd say, hey, here's my day. And uh, next four days are going to be quite busy. So I won't have time to screw around with my music stuff. Again, today was kind of the day I set aside for that. But what is it that I just read on Facebook? Something about. Hey, I didn't fail. I just discovered what didn't, what doesn't work. It's an ongoing project. So after the next four days and after the next following week that I work, I'll have more time to devote to it again. So I'm going to go make the din his dinner, and then I got a hunk of meat out to fry for mine. So I will see you guys later. Bye.